So, briefing the problem of young agriculturists in Chad. Chad is at the heart of Africa between the 8th and 24th degree of north latitude and 13 and 24th degree of longitude east, covering a surface of 1,284,000 square kilometers. It is limited in the north of Bolivia, in the north, Sudan in the south, Central African Republic in the south, and Cameroon in the west. Sorry, I'd like to ask the attention of the room. As you drank Central African coffee, it's exciting, but please pay attention. Thank you. You can continue, Christine. Population of Chad is approximately 12 million we were density varying from the geographical zones. There are three geographical zones distinguished with the climate and the vegetation and the type of soil of soil from south to north Sahelian zone, Sudanian zone, Sahelian zone and Saharian zone. The Sudan zone the most wet receives approximately 1,200 millimeters of rain every year. And the only single ra rain season and starts from end of May to beginning of November. And the volume of precipitations and the duration of the season reduces from south to north. The economy of the country is mainly based on agriculture and pastoralism, strongly affected by the climate change characteristics of the Sahara Sahelian stretch. Approximately 20 million uh, livestock with 7 million uh, cows in the south the valleys and the depressions, the valleys are like the last agricultural lands. Their exploitation needs to be studied with in mind concepts of project and the need of m m managing the diversity of use on, of and types and to foresee the capability, capability with uh, horsemen and respect the environmental balance. The challenges for of the agriculture in Chad. In Chad, agriculture, agriculture has a very important place after uh, after breeding. Its contribution to the uh, GDP is higher than 20%. It's over 20%. The rural sector employs 77% of the population with, uh, agri with an agricultural land of 39 million hectares. Chad has lands that uh, can be irrigated with a surface with a surface of 335,000 hectares. However, less than 2% of this surface is exploited. And this exploitation of agricultural land depends on climate and disparations, disappearance of regions. We distinguish three agricultural zones. The Sahelian zone, where it is very rainy and there is at the same time agriculture and breeding. The Sahelian zone, where agriculture and breeding are practiced, inspired of a, of, of a, of a unrivaled land and extensive agriculture dominated by cereals 
to sell real pencil and sorghum and corn associated with the oil plants and the Sudanese are one of the most 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 productive zones when there is a good rain between 900 and 1000 millimeters of rain per year there is a diversity of production composed of cereals vegetables and cotton Product, agricultural cotton uh, production is submitted to diversity of intemperies that vary from one year to another to important proportions creating a situation of insecurity of food insecurity permanent so that every year the country is trying to uh, complete with importing and food aids from neighbors. We need the essential of your message to tell us about your training. Are you are a trainer? Tell us exactly what you do, especially. Very simple. Don't go too far. This information. What is your message, your main message? I'd like to provide the message about young children and agriculture. In the past, agriculture, commercial agriculture was a source of employment for young people. The crisis experience such as cotton sent a great part of young people to uh, unemployment and also the lacking of political will for the promotion of employment in the agricultural is depends on the climate problems and the lack of uh, training also did not allow integration of youth in the agriculture, in the economy. In many developing countries, young people are running away from the back country to go to a better, to look for a better life in urban centers. This exit, this movement, this migration empties the rural area where the young people and leaving behind only old people who take care of agricultural work with a consequence of reduction of production, reduction of the land exploited, creating a low production, low agricultural production. For perspectives, in relation to the green employment, the region of the south in the south, from this workshop, I wish that the sensitization of young people for uh, to understand, sensitizing the young people to understand that the children now, if young people involved into farm work, this is richness. They won't be unemployed. As I come from the back country, I'd like to make this call to the authorities, administrative authorities, and to the, the state to intervene in our zones in the back country because unemployment has its roots in the province, in the regions. What I have for young people, not only the young country, young people in my region, but all young children to get into 
agriculture and and animal grooming to become rich in, in their lives. Thank you. Uh, I have two questions. Pay attention to the steps. Thank you. Okay. Be careful. We say, when often when we say that our chiefs don't have the will, they say that we've already said in the speech for the independence. We said that in the development program. They have, if they have money, we can ask them to. But people think that it will increase. You touched on one thing that is very important. In our countries, few young people leave the background. In Europe, people are old and space has remained that can be exploited. And the young people are going to Europe and you are saying that you should invest a lot. Give to the director of the Onape. What can he do concretely? Can he go and preach in the mosques and the churches to sensitize young people? Or you said that, what can he do? I'm asking the Onape, the officer. Onape. <laughs> These people who say they can. What Onape can do? to succeed in sensitizing should help women in the back country through organizations and feminine associations and the message will go through. If, um, if I have, if we have a jobless son, we'll get together with my sister to sensitize him to go back to work on the farm. Thank you for saying.